Hi everyone and dear Pega aspirants. Myself Harsha, I am Pega trainer from Harsha Trainings. And I am going to make series of videos about the concept of assignment and routing. So in this series of videos, I am going to explain in detail about uh, what is routing and what are the different ways of routing and what are the tables uh, for assignment and what is the clipboard page of an assignment and like this in depth details about assignment and routing concept you'll be finding the four videos in this series if you are watching the video about the routing concept there may be few videos which are before this video and after this video you will be able to find total four videos about routing concept please don't forget to watch the videos in sequence so before we proceed to watch the video about this explanation so just a small announcement that we are going to start a new training batch on pega starting from may 31st onwards the training duration is three and a half months it's a real-time project oriented training and a job guarantee placement oriented training and anyone who has career gap after their education or who are pursuing any job in non-IT or IT industry or those who are pursuing BTEC as a fresher also are eligible to learn PEGA to get into PEGA jobs. So and one more thing is if you like our videos and the content please don't forget to subscribe our channel and please make sure that if you have any questions don't forget to post the questions in the comment section. The questions may be about the technical questions or maybe the career guidance questions. This is the third video in routing series and where I am going to explain about conditional routing by using decision tree. So you are going to clearly understand how to route either to work list or work basket by using a decision tree. Let's get on to the video of conditional routing now. And now I am going to explain you a separate concept. Let's keep this assignment aside everything I told you about assignment and one more thing I'll tell you routing only look at here in the routing part starting from Pega 8 I think 8 or 7.2 itself right maybe let's see I, I don't remember exactly there is one more option available route to using business logic this is for interview purpose and all you can see so route to single operator route to a common bucket called work queue now what is this route to business logic here you can call it decision tree Let's say I'm calling a tree by name test. Okay. In the decision tree, I will write some condition, right? That is what the purpose of decision tree, right? Here you condition A is equal to 10. For example, if A is equal to 10, return operator ID, I am returning operator 1. This is operator ID. And add one more record. If A is equal to, if A is equal to 20, return work Q1. If none of the conditions satisfied, return work Q2. This is what I have given. When work object reaches assignment, the option for routing is what? Use business logic. Decision tree will run. Based on the condition satisfied, if it returns operator 1, it will be routed to work list, operator 1. If it is returning work Q1, it will be routed to work basket. Okay. So this is called conditional routing either to work list or work basket. Route to single user is dedicatedly routing to one operator route to work queue is dedicatedly routing to work queue as per the requirement my require as per my requirement i may have to either route to operator or work basket i am not sure condition one satisfied i have to route to operator one condition two satisfied i have to route to work queue one condition three satisfied i may have to route to another operator condition four satisfied i may have to route to another work basket none of these satisfied i have, may have to route to default work basket this is the requirement how to achieve that in the routing option you need to choose use business logic and create a decision tree the written values of the decision tree should be either operator ids or work queue names exactly it should match otherwise it will fail understand so this is about conditional routing to either single operator or work basket 